Hi my dear students welcome to our channel learn physics with Gunas sir we are watching our channel first time please subscribe for more updates click the bell icon thank you Today our experiment is torsional pendulum. Aim of the experiment is to determine the rigidity modulus of the given wire by using the torsional pendulum. Torsional pendulum it consists of a uniform metal disc suspended by a wire whose rigidity modulus is to be determined required apparatus chuck nuts metal disc vernier calipers screw gauge meter scale scissor first we need to adjust the length between the two chuck nuts is fixed to a convenient value say 50 centimeters using a meter scale here we need to do this experiment for different lengths like 50 centimeters 60 centimeters 70 centimeters 80 centimeters like that first we are doing here for 50 centimeters A pin is fixed vertically on the edge of the disc for the reference point. Now we have to give a small twist to the wire by turning the disc slightly along the horizontal axis. Start count from the left side it has to go to the right side once again it if it reaches the left one oscillation two oscillations completed like that we have to note the time taken for 20 oscillations three oscillations completed going right side coming left side four oscillations completed like that 20 oscillations Note down the values in the given tabular form. We need to do that for two trials to get the accurate value. And we need to calculate all those formula. In this formula, whatever the values we don't know, we need to measure them by using the vernier calipers and also the screw gaze. Measure the radius of the wire using screw gaze and radius of the disc using the vernier calipers. First, we will calculate the radius of the wire by using the screw gauge. Adjust the screw gauge up to wire between stud is contact. Then take the pitch scale reading PSR and head scale coincidence HSR and tabulate them in our tabular form. During the experiment, first we need to calculate the least kind of screw gauge and error of the screw gauge also then we need to take the readings for three to four times to get the accurate value of the radius of the wire now we will keep the metal disc in between the outer jaws of the vernier calipers to calculate the diameter of the metal disc is also has two scales one is main scale and a second one is vernier scale take the main scale reading from the vernier calipers if you see their main scale reading is 12 and another reading also we need to take that is vernier coincidence here the first line in the vernier scale is directly coinciding the main scale that's where vernier coincidence is one we need to 
note down those values in the given tabular form repeat this experiment three to four times why because we need to get the accurate value from the tabular form we need to calculate the radius of disk and substitute them in the given formula that is rigidity modulus formula eta equals to 8 pi a power 4 by l by t square in that formula finally we will get the answer after we got the reading we have to plot the graph between the length of the wire on x axis and time on y axis the graph will get like that finally we need to write the result with units dynes per centimeter square is the unit for more videos please subscribe my channel thank you for learning here